वेलकम बैक टुडे वी लुक एट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम इजरो सो द क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क्स इन क्रिप्टो कॉपी सेक्शन द क्रिप्टोग्राफिक सेक्शन ऑफ इसरो इज बी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम गेट सो दिस क्वेश्चन माइट नॉट बी आस्क इन गेट सो रीड केयरफुली इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कंटिन्यू लेट्स लुक एट द क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन सेज इन क्रिप्टोग्राफी द फॉलोइंग यूज ऑफ transposition cipher and the keyword is layer encrypt the following messages welcome to net security is a message we have to encrypt it so let's first look at what transposition cipher is i'll just bring back article from wikipedia so it says in cryptography transposition cipher is method of encryption by which position held by unit of plain text are <coughs> shifted according to regular system so it's nothing but we are shifting this bits to one of these so without the keyword layer it's as encryption so no attacker can break this message if i send this message as these bits no one can break except the except without knowing the what keyword is that's how it's work as encryption so how do we encrypt this message let's first look at one message sign message is layer okay one more thing is let's look at the question the question is from transposition cipher so in specific part of transposition cipher this is from columnar transposition so in what happens in columnar transposition the message is written on it in rows in a fixed length so if you are saying it's a if it's a layer the keyword is layer it will be written out in column and according to that you have to give it a number according to alphabet so a comes first in the alphabet so we'll just name it 1 and then e comes so second then 3 4 and 5 now what we do is we just take the message and spread according to according in rows so how do we do this we spread the word word by word according to rows w e l c o m e spaces are omitted during encryption so no need to count the spaces net work security s e c u R I T Y. That's it. We are just ignoring this because it will be same. You can just count this. No, no. Okay, I'll count it. Depends on the question. Question. If they want, don't want to count it, they'll mention in the question. So as we can see, this is distributed among. different columns according to a keyword so if we look at the first number in the keyword which is 1 we can see the we have a column with e e t s i and if you look at the option b we have the column with e e t s i okay let me change the ink E E T S I, and then if we look at second, we have C O O C Y. So let's look at this C C O O C Y, right? Next thing is third. Third is a W M E K R. So we have W M E K R. and then 
fourth is O N R U exclamation mark O N R U exclamation mark and then fifth is L T W E T so L T W E T none of the other more option is matching so this will be our answer it was very simple the thing is you have to understand the transposition cipher and how to get a number from keyword so we we'll just look similar question from is 19 they was given this year this is the question it is the same as previous question they have mentioned the column columnar transposition in which they didn't mention the in previous question but uh, in our course there is only columnar transposition so just remember any transposition cipher will be asked there will be columnar transposition the keyword is given as tomato so keyword is tomato so the keyword is exciting because we have so many repeats T repeats and O repeats. This will be a new challenge. Okay, so given numbering. For numbering, we have to find this one. Second will be M. Third will be. So we have third, which is O. We have two O's. So which one will give in third and which one will give four? Just start from here left to right do the same for other repeats too if you are doing that then you might got wrong answer which is third which is fourth we have same as 2t from where we give 5 this 3 hive and for that we we'll leave 6 now the keyword which is tomato is a plant in the nitrate family I just write it here just here. The tomato is family so one more thing you can see in the question it is there are a lot of X and Y's as you can see X X Y X L is different X you can find every option so how do we get them so the problem is for getting x and y and we have unfinished unfinished sentence here so they just post cross as lawn care here and use them in the question let's just solve the question as we solved before if you want to distinguish them I'll just draw a line I hope this is straight Saved. 
we should do this before yeah. so as you can see we have divided it in a nice way there is no need to do this unless you just want to waste your time or make a longer video so our, our encrypted text will be t ok sorry I'm wrong yeah. start from 1 let's start from 1 yeah. let's start from 1 it will be t i n e s a so do we feel don't care or not let's just feel it because the, it's given the question as in all option x and y is yeah so x is don't care and y is real number so this is the first word let's look at for this in question we have actually 3sm so we have to find another one Second one is this EOL. Okay. Second find by E O A H T F and X. E O H F T X. Yeah. Still there are three. You have to find the third one for distinguish between at least two. Or remove the third so this is the third one starting from H T L T H E Y hey right so this is the okay we can successfully emulate this B1 this won't be any answer Next one is fourth one. Yeah, you can see here starting from M A I I A I. Right? M A I I A I and X. So, okay, both are having M A I X. We have to find the next one, which will be our fifth one. The fifth one is T A P N G D L. So as you can see, by finding fifth one, you can distinguish between this one and this one easily. A and C. So the answer will be A and C will be crossed. If somehow you have mistaken the arrangement will get the wrong answer because as you can see the sixth one is O1 and fifth one is this and if you have accidentally mistaken put this is 5 and this is 6 so you will be getting the wrong answer or even if this will be changing as 3 and 4 you will also get the wrong answer so be careful when you get the similar terms like O and T as keyword just sort them from left to right and then now put the number so this will be one two three four thank you for watching let's look at the next question in the next video